How should drivers apply the gas pedal? A. Slowly and smoothly. B. As quickly as possible. C. By lightly tapping. A. Slowly and smoothly. The gas pedal should be pressed slowly and smoothly. Depressing the pedal too quickly can cause the vehicle's wheels to spin too fast or cause the vehicle to slide, especially if the pavement is wet. Signs that are orange colored are A. Work zone signs B. Regulatory signs C. School zone signs A. Work zone signs Highway work zones are established according to the type of work underway along the roadway. Signs in work areas are typically diamond-shaped, orange, and displaying black letters or symbols. They serve as a warning that people are working on or near the highway. This sign means A. One-way traffic B. Intersection ahead C. Merging traffic from the right. C. Merging traffic from the right. Warning signs are usually yellow with black markings. They alert you to conditions that are immediately ahead. This sign tells drivers to prepare to allow traffic to safely merge from the right. You are approaching an intersection at the posted speed limit when the signal turns yellow. You should A. Slow down and proceed through the intersection without caution. B. Speed up to cross the intersection before the light turns red. C. Stop before entering the intersection, if you can do so safely. C. Stop before entering the intersection, if you can do so safely. A solid yellow light means, caution, and signals that the light will soon turn red. You should stop at a solid yellow light if you can do so safely, otherwise, you should cautiously cross the intersection. Want to issue DMV test? Go to CheatSheets.com and get your guaranteed cheat sheet. If you have a sudden tire blowout? A. Use the brakes lightly. B. Pump the brakes. C. Apply the brakes firmly. A. Use the brakes lightly. If a tire suddenly goes flat while you are driving, hold the steering wheel tightly and keep the vehicle moving straight. Slow down gradually by taking your foot off the gas pedal and using the brakes lightly. This sign means A. Do not drink and drive. B. Slippery when wet. C. Road curves ahead. B. Slippery when wet. Warning signs are usually yellow with black markings. They alert you to conditions that are immediately ahead. This sign warns that the roadway is slippery when wet. This is the shape and color of a fill in the blank sign. A. Stop. B. Wrong way. C. Yield. C. Yield. Downward facing triangular signs mean drivers must yield. When approaching a yield sign, slow down to a speed that is reasonable for existing conditions and stop if necessary. If you must stop, do so at a marked stop line, if it exists. If you are feeling fatigued while driving, you should A. Increase your speed to reach your destination more quickly. B. Increase the volume of your radio. C. Find a safe parking area to take a short nap. C. Find a safe parking area to take a short nap. When driving, watch for warning signs of fatigue. You are too tired to drive safely if you are struggling to keep your eyes open, drifting from your lane, or turning up the radio and rolling down your windows to keep yourself awake. 
If you notice these signs, it is a good idea to find a safe place to park so you can refresh yourself with a short nap. Which of these statements is true about roadwork zones? A. Fines are the same for violations committed in work zones as they are under normal traffic conditions. B. You must, slow for the cone zone. C. Slow down only if you think workers are present. B. You must, slow for the cone zone. Reduce your speed and be prepared to slow down or stop for highway equipment. Driving carefully through work zones improves safety for drivers, pedestrians, bicyclists, and road workers. As you approach the top of a hill, you should a. Speed up slightly. b. Prepare to stop, if needed. c. Maintain a steady speed. b. Prepare to stop, if needed. You may not know what is on the other side of a hill or just around a curve, even if you have driven the road many times. If a vehicle is stalled just out of sight on the roadway, you must be able to stop. Whenever you come to a hill or curve, adjust your speed so you can stop if necessary. Drivers turning left must yield to A. Oncoming vehicles traveling straight or turning right. B. Passing cars. C. No one in particular. A. Oncoming vehicles traveling straight or turning right. Drivers making a left turn must yield to all vehicles approaching from the opposite direction. This includes bicycles and motorcycles. If you are being followed too closely on a multi-lane highway, you should A. Speed up to match the speed of the car behind you. B. Move into the lane to your right and let the other car pass. C. Slow down to antagonize the driver. B. Move into the lane to your right and let the other car pass. If you are being followed too closely while driving in the left lane of a multi-lane roadway, merge to your right to allow the other car to pass. The far left lane on a multi-lane road is intended for use by faster moving vehicles passing slower traffic. If your car becomes disabled while on the highway, you should A. Stop in the right lane. B. Park with all four wheels off the traveled highway, if possible. C. Stop where you are. B. Park with all four wheels off the traveled highway, if possible. If your vehicle becomes disabled, you must, if possible, park with all four wheels off of the main traveled portion of the road. To avoid glare from the headlights of an approaching car? A. Look briefly toward the right side of the road. B. Stay focused on the center line on the road. C. Flash your high beams. A. Look briefly toward the right side of the road. You should avoid looking toward the bright lights of an oncoming vehicle by glancing toward the right side of the road. After looking briefly toward the side of the road, continue looking ahead to check on the position of the other vehicle. What is the only medically proven method of removing alcohol or other drug combinations from your system? A. Breathe in some fresh air. B. Give your body time. C. Drink coffee. B. Give your body time. Alcohol takes effect quickly and is slow to leave your system. Cold showers, black coffee, and exercise will do nothing to reduce a person's blood alcohol content, BAC. The only way to lower your BAC is to wait. If you come to an intersection and your view to the side is blocked, you should A. Slow down and look both ways. B. Maintain your speed and look both ways. C. 
stop, then inch forward until you can see clearly in both directions. C. Stop, then inch forward until you can see clearly in both directions. Drivers must slow down when approaching an intersection. If a clear view of cross traffic is obscured, a driver should come to a stop and inch forward until they can see clearly in both directions. This sign means A. No right turn. B. You must turn right. C. Watch for traffic on your right. A. No right turn. This sign prohibits right turns. You cannot make a right turn at an intersection where this sign is posted. You must show proof of insurance to law enforcement. A. Only if you are involved in a collision. B. If you are involved in a collision or stopped for a citation. C. Only if you are stopped and cited. B. If you are involved in a collision or stopped for a citation. You must have evidence of financial responsibility, such as proof of insurance, with you whenever you drive. You must always show proof of insurance and your license to an officer upon request after a traffic stop or collision. If a motorist sees pedestrians in an upcoming crosswalk, what should the motorist do? A. Continue ahead. The motorist has the right of way. B. Wait for the pedestrians to cross the street. C. Pull to the right and go around the pedestrians. B. Wait for the pedestrians to cross the street. A driver must yield the right of way to a pedestrian within a crosswalk. The driver should wait until the intersection is clear to proceed. When being passed by another vehicle. A. Brake hard. B. Maintain a constant speed. C. Speed up. B. Maintain a constant speed. When being passed, you must yield to the passing vehicle and not increase your speed. Allow the vehicle to safely merge back into your lane. When arriving to an uncontrolled intersection at the same time as vehicles to your right and left, you should A. Yield the right of way to the vehicle on your left. B. Yield the right of way to the vehicle on your right. C. Wait until there are no vehicles at the intersection before proceeding. B. Yield the right of way to the vehicle on your right. If multiple vehicles arrive at the same time to an intersection that is not controlled by signs or signals, the driver on the right has the right of way. Drivers should then proceed in the order that they arrive to the intersection. At intersections with stop signs on all corners. A. The vehicle to arrive first has the right of way. B. The vehicle to arrive last has the right of way. C. Drivers should always offer to let other cars proceed first. A. The vehicle to arrive first has the right of way. At intersections with stop signs on all corners, cars should proceed in the order that they arrive. Come to a complete stop and yield the right of way to any vehicle that arrived to the intersection before you. Use your headlights on rainy, snowy, or foggy days. A. To keep your engine warm. B. So others can see your vehicle. C. To warn others of bad weather conditions. B. So others can see your vehicle. On rainy, snowy, or foggy days, it may be difficult for other drivers to see your vehicle. Under these conditions, headlights make your vehicle easier to see. If the weather requires you to turn on your windshield wipers, you must also turn on your low beam headlights.
When approaching a person who is crossing the street while using a white cane or guide dog, you should a. Stop until the person is well away from your path of travel. b. Honk your horn as you proceed past them. c. Carefully drive around them. a. Stop until the person is well away from your path of travel. When approaching a pedestrian who is using a white cane or guide dog while crossing the street, you must stop until the person is well away from your path of travel. Always yield the right of way to blind pedestrians. This sign means A. Side road. B. Merge. C. Yield the right of way. A. Side road. This sign indicates that there is an intersection with a side road ahead.